Howdy everyone, welcome back to the Luna, Geek Out, the Luna Geeks Out channel, and today we got a pretty dang good reaction, I hope so at least, uh, today we are reacting to G999, uh, probably many different ways you could say that, by Moonbeal featuring Marani, hope I'm saying that right. This is off of, uh, Moonbeal's upcoming, uh, upcoming solo album, six sequence i think would be the way to say that i don't really know but it's, it should be really good i'm a big moonbeal fan hoss is my bias and mom but moonbeal's pretty dang good now before we hop into this i just want to say one quick thing about what's going on next couple weeks on the channel this week there's going to be one more reaction i don't know what day it is because i'm not great with time but there's gonna be another reaction coming out sometime this week i hope uh, because there's something being released this week that I'm really looking forward to. Not going to give too many spoilers on that, but it should be pretty good. And then next week, there will be a reaction going to be out on vacation, so it's uh, going to be pre-recorded. I don't know when I'm going to record it, but th there will almost certainly be a reaction next week. Uh, it'll probably be a metal track. I was going to do Dreamcatcher, but I've done a lot of pop stuff lately, and I want to get back into some metal. I, we did the Eskimo Cowboy thing last week, I think, but you know, I want to get into some more metal because I've been doing a lot of pop stuff lately. I don't know what it'll be yet, but it'll be good if I can get it to work. But things are a little chaotic right now. I don't know what's, what it's going to be like after that, but things should get back to some semblance of normalcy pretty soon. Anyways, without further ado, let's get into it. Alright, cool vibe starting off. I love this sense right there. There's uh, some some metal track I know that has them, oh, and uh, they're just a lot of fun. Just this old retro sense. Sort of like a synth drum kind of thing. I don't know. Like that little bit right there. Right there. Those ones go up a bit. That's just cool. Oh, it stopped. Okay, <laughs> that was a bit sudden. Alright, yeah, that was pretty dang good. That was pretty dang good. 
Uh, I'm gonna take a look at the lyrics, see if I have anything to say on them, and then I'll talk about the music. Or I have no idea what's going on with the lyrics, but it does mention D-Day, so, uh, good sabotage reference. <laughs> ah, that's stupid. <laughs> but no, I, I got nothing of what's going on in the lyrics. Uh, it really wasn't that funny. <laughs> I'll be with y'all in a moment, I gotta just laugh at this. <laughs> Alright, yeah, I apologize for that terrible joke. That was just for me, and I really should not have found it as funny as I did. But I got nothing on the lyrics, no idea what's going on there. If y'all if y'all know, let me know, I'm curious, but nah, I got nothing. Um, But musically, it was a solid track. I have liked the other stuff I've heard from Moonbeal more, but I, th I think this was good. It had a fairly... I don't know, there wasn't much going on, which actually really worked. The The video really, um, I guess complimented that. It was a very simple video, just the two of them, um, had just sort of that older aesthetic to it, um, and it, it, it was nice. It didn't do anything too crazy, but it was nice. Uh, the, the vocals, I uh, can start off with vocals, I think. They were solid, um, they didn't really stand out to me too much, but you know, they, they were really good. I did really like the part where they went up a bit, um, Guest vocalist Marani was really good. I, I'm gonna check out her stuff eventually because um, she, she did a really good job on this. And um, yeah, I, I think she and Mumbio worked together really, really well. Uh, well. There wasn't too much of the vocals that really went like, oh yeah, they're doing a really good job here. Um, this is just the, the good vocal performance from both. Like, the, the synths that I mentioned, uh, I don't even know how to describe them, but they, they were cool, sort of the just old retro kind of sound, but again, this, this had just, I want to say sort of like a 90s feel, but I, I'm not too familiar with music from the 90s, at least not this type, this style of music. I, I know a decent amount of metal from back then, but when it comes to whatever type of music this is uh, reminiscent of, I know next to nothing on it, but just, it, it has that sort of feel to it to me. And... I don't know, it gave me just a little hint of nostalgia, which was really nice. Um, one of those instances where I'm getting some nostalgia for something that I never really experienced. Like, I've been, I've been playing um, Halo Combat Evolved over on my gaming channel. Check it out, you won't regret it, it's a good channel. <laughs> and I'm getting a lot of nostalgia from the game, but I never played the Halo games before. This is my first playthrough, but it's the same kind of thing. I, I'm not too familiar with this. I didn't have anything to really base this off on with, like, you know, my, my childhood or whatever, but I'm getting some nostalgia with this, which is nice, and it was just, it was a fun song, which, um, I've talked about this sometimes. I really love talking about, you know, the, the stuff that has all the wild stuff going on. Um, like, one of these days, Sleep Token's gonna release something new, and I'm gonna be able to talk about them, and I'm gonna go all out on my commentary on all this stuff, because Sleep Token is wild. Sometimes you really, really need to do that. Sometimes, or sometimes I really need to be able to talk about that wild stuff that I can talk about all the different elements of. And sometimes I just get a fun little song that isn't doing anything too crazy, and sometimes that's all you need. I'm pretty sure I've had rants similar to that before on here. I know I've made rants similar to that before. I just don't know if I've actually done them on this channel or not. But it was, it was a lot of fun. Um... Cannot wait to see what comes next on that one. I know there's one more track with someone featured on it, and, uh, I think I heard that, uh, what is it, Miracle Three Days Ago, whatever it is, I think I heard that that is going to be on the album, I, I don't know for sure, but I have not heard that yet, um, so, if y'all think that'll make a good reaction, whether or not it's on the album, uh, you know, let me know down in the comments, and I'll add it to the list, and I'll try to get that one done fairly quickly, um, but I don't, I don't have too much to say on this one, it was, just, it was a fun track, uh, the, vi the video was simple, but it was nice, it complimented it, um, this is going straight into my mix and everything, I just... I don't know, didn't it really hit me in any way where it was like, oh yeah, I got a lot to talk about with this part of it or whatever. It's just good solid track. But yeah, that's gonna do it for the video, so thank you all for watching. Be sure to like if you liked, subscribe if you want to see more, and comment down below with your own thoughts on the track, any feedback or criticism, or anything you want me to react to. In the description, there'll be a link to the music video, so go check it out, support the artist, a link to my Discord server, a link to my Instagram, and a link to my Spotify playlist of all the tracks I've reacted to on here, and um... 
I'll link to the link tree of all the other stuff that I have in case any of you want to check it out. Be sure to join the Discord server. Need more folks in there. It's a good little community. And uh, yeah, like I said, that's going to do it. So once again, thank you all for watching. And until next time, I'll be seeing you.